Hello, Reborn Warmies. How's it going? Here I am again. I felt like doing another video. And so I thought I would tell you a little bit about what's going on with my nursery. And then, um, well, first of all, here's Zoe Lynn. And she still has on the same outfit that I had on from the last video. And I uh, haven't had time to change her clothes. But as you can see, she's playing on the mat and she's hanging on to her bottle. And over here, I have Elena and Hayden. Hayden fell asleep in a stroller. And I told him that I would read a story to them and they can pick whatever book they wanted. So he had some of these books that he picked there and then Elena picked the My House video. So I'm going to go ahead and read that to them. But I, let me tell you a little bit about my nursery. A long time ago when I first moved down to Texas, I told you guys that I was going to set up my nursery and I'd show it to you and that never happened because I really never did set up a nursery um well a little bit as you'll see because basically i went from a room nursery a full room nursery when I, where i was living in minnesota to sort of a closet nursery slash craft room slash nursery <laughs> um and you'll see what i mean in a minute because i share my craft room with my nursery and the babies and then my crib is in the other room but basically i put my nursery in the closet as far as like the changing table and uh, the some of their clothes and stuff like that is over here but then some of their clothes is on the other side in that cabinet and then in those drawers there's oh there's the twins I forgot to show you uh, Michaela and hey, uh, Layton so they're down there ready for story time also but so my nursery and then these over here are my craft items because I had a nursery and then I had a um, a craft room in the lower level of the house I was living in in Minnesota. And so I had to consolidate a lot of things when I moved in with my mom and dad. But I'm very happy that I actually, you know, have two rooms and not one because that would have never worked. And then on the top, I have a lot of their boxes with different things in it for the babies and then on the end there I have their diaper bags and then I have some of their clothes hanging and then some are in the drawers that I showed you and stuff so anyways I intended to only put clothes over the white boxes there and then I was going to leave the rest of it open I was going to leave um, this section here open and this section over here I was going to leave open so that I could put different things on the back wall for the changing table and then I slowly I started taking out some of the clothes from the drawer saying I'm going to put this on and put that on and eventually the clothes started kind of coming over the top of the nursery. So I have to totally reorganize this whole thing and um, put some of the clothes away. Because I don't want the clothes actually going all across the nursery. Um, because I want to decorate the back wall there. And I hope to get to that some someday I haven't gotten to it yet so anyway that is kind of my closet nursery or basically uh, my changing table for the babies 
And I do use that changing table a lot whenever I change the babies. Okay, so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to read a book to the twins. So I'm going to go ahead and put the camera in and uh, switch it around. Well, actually, I am going to... I'm trying something new and so I'm going to go ahead and I'll be back and I will uh, share a video I mean a story with you with the babies 